Hey howdy hey partners, today we have brand new Lightyear mission gear. Let's get into it. I am Socks, your personal companion robot, and I regret having joined you. You're watching Today I Grew Up, Lightyear Edition. Enjoy the review. You can also click the card here in the corner of your screen, and that'll take you to all the Lightyear toy reviews that I'm reviewing on this channel. Hey howdy hey partners, super excited to be back again with more Lightyear toy reviews. The movie, The Andy Experience, I'm going to an early screening tomorrow night, so I'm very excited. It's actually my birthday today, so wish me in the comment section happy birthday to me. And for my birthday today, I got these awesome presents. This Mission Gear Utility Belt retails for $16.99, so it's not that expensive. It includes a fuel crystal, which is pretty cool. The crystal's right there, as you can see. It comes with this cool belt clip. Now, I don't know if this fits older space rangers like me or you know adult size so we'll have to figure that out and here it also has the visor which we got and the laser blade here on the back it says store and go so you can store your crystal and there's a crystal activates hidden compartment so that'll be exciting to check out so bad news if you aren't a skinny little space ranger this won't fit you i tried putting this belt up to my my pants and it only fit halfway around my body so it's not going to fit me at all but if you are a skinny little space ranger it'll definitely fit you you can you know have it buckle there it's you know size adjusting fit to what you are has a little belt um holder for if you're too skinny uh, so that's cool and then it's got this little cool compartment here where you open up there's nothing in there obviously it comes with a crystal you can just kind of store it in there close the buckle there and then take it back out if you'd like to probably could fit two of those crystals in here actually um, if you wanted to store it there here's a cool feature you put the crystal in this compartment you push it down and it opens up this secret thing with a secret switch it doesn't really do anything it has clicking noises but it's just to set levels i think it's just for fun and then inside it looks kind of like a communicator or some kind of digital map or something it's just a sticker but it's pretty cool nonetheless if you want to do that it's just a pop-open feature the little crystal which is nice this right here doesn't really do anything it's got a little switch i wish it had lights and sounds it does not uh it just kind of slides onto the belt there it's like a clip so you, i can technically put this on any kind of belt that i want and um what i'm thinking is what i can do since it doesn't fit me probably can get another belt that does fit me and just transfer the parts over because i could clip these on to the new belt so maybe i'll work on that for a future project Put these pieces on a belt that does fit me maybe that'll work but it's cool that it has a little space ranger logo nothing much to this belt it's just kind of like this rubbery plastic material but it's pretty cool crystal itself is kind of this hollow plastic i wish they would have put a real crystal in there it's kind of like this purpley tint color which is nice i do like that detail and this will probably fit exactly with a five inch scale buzzes i notice this is the same as the five inch scale crystals so that is pretty neat accessory Next, let's look at the visor. It's $19.99. That is a little expensive, I feel, for what you get. Um, there is a button here. It doesn't really do anything. It does have these little rubbery grips for your ears, so it doesn't hurt your head. It's a really nice strap that's, uh, you know, it's it has a lot of room to give. So if you have a, a big head or a smaller head, it should fit you. It's like a one-size-fits-all. I actually tried this on, and it does fit me. So it does fit an adult head, normal size one. The visor does go up, and it does go down. So... I wish it had a, the button triggered the visor to go up and down, but it does not. It's just up and down manually. So it's pretty simple, straightforward. This is marketed as a training visor. We'll have to watch the movie to find out more what that actually means. But it's pretty comfortable, you know. It's got a little rubbery piece here for your forehead, so it's not uncomfortable. And it definitely fits my head. My favorite part, the Laser Blade DX. This is something I've been waiting for since I saw it in the store. It is $24.99 right now. I know sometimes in Target it's marked as $29.99. Check the Target app because it is cheaper there as well as Amazon.com. You can find it for $24.99. Really like the box. I like that in the box they kind of uh, put the artwork of the laser blade. And you can see it kind of light up through the back, which is pretty fun for packaging. This is my favorite prop that I've seen, and it's super cool because it reminds me of a lightsaber. Let's open it up. So this laser blade runs on three AAA batteries. It does include them when you buy them, so that is pretty sweet. You don't have to purchase the batteries. It already comes with batteries. I really like the size of it because I feel like it is an appropriate size for not only young but older space rangers like me who can hold it. And in my hand, it doesn't feel super small. It does feel like, 
you know, I could cosplay with it, no problem. It is super cool. So on the bottom, you notice there's switches here. This left side is the store demo mode. The middle is off, so that means it won't trigger anything when you press the trigger button. This is the play mode. So this is the full play mode. We're gonna go through the laser sounds and see what that's about. When you put it on on mode, it just stays on and you can wave it around and it makes sounds. So as you hear it toggles through those whoosh modes and hitting noises and then if you press the trigger again it'll make that sound when you hit the trigger. And then let's see what happens when we don't press anything or move it around if it turns off by itself. We'll see what happens. Many, many minutes later. So it's been about a couple minutes and it's still on. So I assume as long as the switch is on, it's gonna stay on. Uh, let's put it back in the try me store mode, see what happens with that. So with the store try me mode, it just toggles through the different modes. But if you put it on full on mode, you're gonna have that lightsaber kind of hum the whole time. And it even turns on like a lightsaber. As you see, it slowly turns on. I wish it had the same effect going back when you turned it off, but it does not. So that is very interesting. It just stays on. As long as you have it on on mode and you're playing with it. It'll just keep doing that. So this is very cool. I really love this prop. It's super awesome. I think it's super weird that the logos are pretty much on uh, one side over the other. We do have the caution striping there, but on this side we actually have the caution word as well as the star command DX09, which is cool. Now I wonder how this is going to play out in the movie, but it's pretty comfortable to the grip. And I really like the way it feels in hand. This laser blade feels quality, doesn't feel cheap at all. I do like that it's kind of weighted as well. This is my favorite prop I think so far from the Lightyear merch is to have this in hand. It really makes you feel like Lightyear, you know, slashing the blade around. So I cannot wait to watch this in action in the movie and it's super cool to have it in hand in real life. All right partners, this is the visor test. As you can see the visor actually fits my head. I have no issues with it at all. It's pretty comfortable actually and putting the visor down, check it out. But what do you think of this? This looks really cool. Kind of sounds kind of echoey once I close the visor, but it's really cool that you just kind of flick it up and down and there's no issues with it. It's pretty solid. I really like it a lot. I feel like a recruit already for Lightyear with my blade. Let's turn it on for the full experience. I'm coming for you, Zerg. Come on, Zerg. Prepare to meet your match. That's right. Let's turn on the saber for the full experience. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, Zerg. Get out of my way, Zyclops. Get out of my way, Zerg. Our recruits are going to get you. Buzz! This is so cool. Well, partners, I had a fun time reviewing this mission equipped gear. Super awesome to cosplay, and I think it's super fun to see the movie come to life in your hands with the laser blade, my favorite prop. Highly recommend these items, they're super cool. Should be able to find them on Amazon. Walmart or Target, go out there, happy toy hunting. Hope you find all your toys that you want to collect to build your collection. As always, partners, thank you so much for liking and commenting on these videos. Really helps support this channel. If you want to continue on this journey with me, all you have to do is hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell so you learn for future videos on this channel, and I'll see you partners on the next video review. You want the real buzz like you? You're, a, no, you're an action figure. You are a sad, 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 strange little man.
You are a sad, 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 strange little man. You are a child plaything! Hey, Ham, look, I'm Picasso. I don't get it. 